Hey everybody, I'm attorney Mike Content. A question I'm often asked is, can the police locate me by pinging my cell phone like you see on TV shows like NCIS and FBI and all that? And the short answer is, sometimes under the right circumstances, they may be able to do that. But it's important to understand that pinging a cell phone is a real thing. But the police themselves don't typically have the ability to do it. They have to contact the cell phone, cell phone provider who then sends a signal out to the phone and that shows where the phone is using the GPS locator in the phone. Um, but it's important to understand that the police just can't do this anytime they want, all right? Um, and that's because um, the courts have decided that cell phones are so indispensable in modern society. Everybody has one. Uh, you use it for making calls, text, emailing, uh, business, taking photographs, uh, storing things. Uh, every, everybody's got a phone, everyone uses it for different purposes. But the idea is that society as a whole doesn't expect that the police will be able to manipulate your, your device, your phone. Um, and the courts have said that's a reasonable expectation that you, the police shouldn't just be able to ping your phone or otherwise manipulate your phone without some oversight. And that oversight comes by way of a warrant. So under the right set of circumstances, if the police have probable cause to believe you're committing a crime and they need to find you, and that pinging your cell phone is the only reasonable way to do so, uh, they can go to the court and provide specific information in an affidavit to a clerk, magistrate, or a judge who can then uh, review everything and say, you know what, I think that's enough, and they can actually issue a search warrant. And with that search warrant, they are allowed to contact the provider, have them ping the cell phone, and find out exactly where you are, are at that time, or at least where your cell phone is at that time, but most people have it on them all the time, so for all intents and purposes, they're locating you uh, most of the time, they're actually gonna ping your phone. Um, there are exceptions to that, because not every case where they should have a warrant, they always need one. Uh, what I mean by that is there are exceptions when, uh, usually emergency types of exceptions, where the police wouldn't actually need a warrant, okay? Uh, they call these exigent circumstances, okay? Where making a warrant is what the law calls impracticable, which is really, really difficult in a short amount of time to prevent something bad from happening. Um, in a recent case last year, the police said, um, the police did exactly that. They contacted the provider. They didn't have a warrant. And the court said, you know what? You really should have a warrant, but we're gonna let it stand this time because of the particular circumstances. In that case, the circumstances were, they're looking for a guy who went up to another guy in a driver with a sawed off shotgun, shot him, then he's on the run. Now they're afraid this guy's gonna hurt somebody else. Uh, they're afraid that he might destroy evidence or basically escape, and it's really important that that not happen. So the court said under these types of circumstances, we're gonna find an exception to the time you need a warrant. But that's not just the random circumstance. That's a pretty extreme situation. In most cases, in order to locate you using your cell phone by pinging that cell phone uh, like you see on TV, the police just can't do that. They, they typically will need a warrant in order to do so. Um, so you can uh, feel free to understand that you have a privacy in that and the police aren't just gonna be doing that uh, randomly to you. Uh, that would be against the law. And if that were to happen, any evidence they find as a result of that, we could get suppressed in court. So if you have any questions about the privacy rights in your cell phone, about this pinging of your cell phone, or anything related to uh, criminal, criminal law, criminal defense, please feel free to give me a call, shoot me an email, I'll be happy to speak to you about it.